Not the Shabby. Reminds me of the Wonderboss show I saw back in Canterlot. Oh, that's pretty impressive. Good job, Rainbow. <coughs> Ugh, that looked painful. Yeah. But what did I tell you about using your magic? Hey, it's not my fault that you suck. You sure? Something was definitely pulling me down. The wind doesn't just change direction like that. Actually, it does. I didn't. Yeah, I guess you're right. Unless you're some kind of stealth spy pony. I'm a Metal Gear. I'm Solid Snake, the magical unicorn stealth pony. And you just messed it up. Just your average unicorn. I don't know any stealth spells. But I know about Metal Gear! Uh huh? That doesn't make any sense. Something caused me to. er. Uh, well. Crash? Yeah, it wasn't my fault. I don't know what happened. It could happen. Only on the hub. <laughs> my ears are ringing. Hey, look. Don't tell any pony about the crashing part, okay? Please? Mm. I have a reputation to uphold. I'm practically a hero to Ponyville. I have a fan club and everything. Run by Philly that might be a bit... too uh, obsessed. Yeah, I wonder why. So let's just keep this between us, okay? Please? Uh, I don't know. It was fun. Oh, but it's so funny. Every pony will get a kick out of this. Because seriously, Crushing Ram Dash is awesome. No, no, no! I can't have ponies laughing at me! So many cults and fillies look up to me! I have fans! If you tell ponies, they'll just laugh at me! I want ponies laughing with me, not at me! Hmm... They'll start calling me Rainbow Crash in the streets! I won't be able to show my face in Ponyville again and I'll have to... I get the feeling they won't believe me anyway. Gotcha! Leave town and I... Wait... What? Gotcha! I'm only teasing Rainbow Dash. I'm a troll! You... you pranked me? Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's hilarious! You really got me, new pony. <laughs> You're quite the prankster. <laughs> I love pranks! I can't believe I fell for that. <laughs> Good one, new pony. I think I gotta get going. But we'll hang out sometime, okay? Sure! See you around! See ya! Yeah. <sighs> Rainbow Dash is now my a quay dance. <sighs> well, maybe if you wake up every 3 a.m. Anyway, time for a shower. Scene three, the subtle of mass. Oh. <coughs> what the buck? What did that? Yes, it's an invasion of space ponies. The space ponies are coming. Huh. Yes, yes, I'm fine. Ooh, what happened? Ah, nothing to worry about. Just made a slight miscalculation. Or two. Or, uh, <clears throat> three. So I took with ooze sometimes. Just can't quite get a grip on anything. Yeah. Suck me out, pony. I mean, I could use my mouth, I suppose, but then I get saliva everywhere. Oh well, nothing does a machine better than an old dowsing in ponies rule. Mm hmm. Oh, wait, you there. You, you have magic. Yeah. Why you send me a hoof, would you? Although I suppose in your case it's more like lending a horn. I don't know. Apparently I used to suck with my magic. Anyways, let's get to work. Also, it's Dr. Hoofs. It's awesome, even though I never saw Dr. Who. Anyway, let's do it. It's really simple. There's no math or science. Basically, just putting the right shape to the right place and twisting. Okay. Should be something even you can do. Just tighten a few screws. Nothing fancy and no explosions. I promise. Mm -hmm. At least there shouldn't be any explosions. Will there be explosions? Well, I don't know. You're the duck. Mm, I don't know. 
Sure, sir. So I'm just up around. Precisely. Okay. Correct. Magic makes life easier. If only I was better at it. Is it all of them? Yes. Yes, it is. Good job. You just accomplished a mindlessly mundane task. Granted, I couldn't even get it right. Hooves and mouth. Not the best operating tools. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no problem. So, who are you exactly? Who am I? Oh, yes, of course. I'm the doctor. Not that it's terribly important. Why, yes, it is. You are Dr. Hoofs. You are one admired by so many fans. Thanks for the help. Perhaps I'll need it again sometime. Uh, what was your name? My name is New Pony! Oh, damn it, Mortifix. Thanks again, Assistant. Oh, and by the way, you obviously said damn it. It says so in the sound files. Haha. -ha. Anyway. Dr. Hoofs is now a ma ha ha a great dance. Mm-hmm. Oh, hey, it's your wife. Yes, sir. Might you spare a moment? Hmm... Okay. Please, call me Floor. My full name is Floor Delise, but it could get rather tedious to say the entire thing. Floor Delise, Floor Delise, Floor Delise. I don't know. Does sound that hard. Okay, Fleur, so what can I do for you? I was hoping you could point me in the direction of Town Hall. I've been looking for it, but... But I think I'm only succeeding in disorienting myself. How about buying a map? Why, yes, I am. I just arrived here from Canterlot, actually. I haven't ever been in Ponyville before. Well, that is, I have ridden the train through town, but never actually stopped to walk around. Smart. Not that there is anything wrong with Ponyville. I was just always passing through. Yep. Same old Cantalot managed. But it seems a bit different somehow. Mm hmm. It's a whole new world. Anyway, let's help her. Oh, I see. So you are in a similar situation to myself, dear. Mm hmm. Except I've only been here for a few days longer. I'm hoping to move in later today. I just don't know where to start. Well, you could start in the town hall. Oh, why thank you, dearie. I do not wish to be a bother. You certainly don't have to walk me all the way there. Eh, I don't mind. Indeed, nothing anything better to do anyway. Oh, well thank you. Here you are. I sent you over it well further. Anything else you need? Thank you ever so much, dearie. You have been most helpful. Once I get my new home, would you care to join me for tea? I'm not familiar with any ponies in this town. Mm -hmm. Perhaps we could be friends. Nah, uh, that's a hard question. I like the friend stuff, but I hate tea. Seriously, I don't like tea. Neither do I like coffee. Anyway, let's do the tea. Even though I have to suffer. Seriously, I hate tea. Wonderful. Thank you again for helping me. I look forward to having tea with you, new friend. Yeah, I don't. Oh well. See you later. I certainly will. Thank you again. Fleur is now your uh, amazing cool friend. Well, I'm... I got to have money. Let's see on the sweeter bike. Hmm. Hey there, whippersnapper. Come to check out the orchards, have ya? Oh no. Do you check off the grannies? Work here. Ah, now I get it. 
You're that new fella that was helping out my granddaughter the other day. Yes, because she paid me. Hmm. No, nope, don't think she is. Why you want to know? Because I want money. <laughs> well, shucks. You ain't got to go explaining it. You're sweet on her, ain't ya? Mm-hmm. I suppose she is getting to that age. The age to give me all our money? Is she single? Yep, she is. I don't want her. I want the money. What's that? I got to have money. What? Yeah, forget it. Whoa there, youngin. You best leave that between you and her. You dirty old lady. Shame on you! You're certainly a strange one, but that's okay. Most of Ponyville thinks I'm a crazy old lady. I wonder why. <laughs> Can you believe that? Mm-hmm. There you are, Granny Smith. Apple Bloom has been looking for you. Oh my god, Big Macintosh has spoken! Apple Bloom? Mm-hmm. That's right. Told her I'd teach her how to make apple pie. Must have slipped my mind. Gotta go. Gotta go fast. Yep. Nope. Ah. Oh well. Maybe Rainbow Dash has some fun stuff to do. Like crashing. No. Excuse me, dear fellow. Yes, you there, old chap. Are you a diamond dog? Huh. Ah. I'm quite glad you asked. You see, I'm on a bit of a quest. A treasure hunt, if you will. Yeah, I have a question for you too. When did you go from GEMS! GEMS! LOTS OF GEMS, MISS RARITY! To... Excuse me, sir. Could you tell me where I could find some slender gems? Because it makes no sense. Unless you're in the mastermind. Would you happen to know where a gentle fellow, such as myself, could happen to peruse a selection of fine diamonds or perhaps other precious stones? Yeah, underground. Quite. I am interested in acquiring some ostentatious regalia. Hmm. Okay, so diamonds, hmm. Hey, that's right. You can steal some from Spike. Spike's had lots of gems. Because he's greedy at times, you know. Excellent. And where might one find this quaint little boutique? At the giant tree library. There is Spike, with all of his chimes and gems. Ah, thank you, good sir. I certainly appreciate your time. Here, allow me to compensate you for your trouble. Some random guy gives you 10 bits. Yeah, that sounds trustworthy. But of course. Come now, Brutus. We must inform our compatriots of our discovery. But boss, why do we need to round up the boys? It's just a prissy pony booty. Silence, you fool! We can't just te- Uh, that is to say, I wish to make a somewhat grandiose purchase. May need help transporting all of it. Yeah, that's a good idea. Indeed they do. Well then, I bid thee farewell. Yeah. Farewell, creepy old diamond dog thingy. Gravity should be pleased. I sent him some business away. Although I would rather send him to Spike. Anyway, let's see if Gravity's kidnapped yet. Hello there. Welcome to... Oh, it's you! Yes, it's new pony! It's nice to see you again. How are you faring in your new home? It's awesome. How are you? Busy, busy, busy. You know, the usual. So what can I do for you today, darling? Looking for a stylish new coat? Not right now. Work? Oh, but of course. I'm afraid I don't have any at this moment. I'll be in need of your assistance soon, though. I have to make a few new outfits for a 